Fletcher, I'd like to ask Fletcher to come up. Um, the, sorry, the Reverend Fletcher Harper, um, <laughs> to talk about the the declaration for a few minutes. I think this will be be very very brief because I'm all that's standing between you and the enlightened wisdom of Sister Jayanti, who's going to share that with us, which will be a wonderful way truly to to close. So as, as you all know, I believe uh, a team has put together this, this multi-faith statement, which I think is absolutely beautifully written. Um, it has gathered many, many, many signatures from high-level religious leaders as well as everyday people of faith uh, and spirituality around the world. We will keep the, the signing of that open. What we'll do is when we hand the statement to the UN tomorrow, um, we will have them you know, we'll, we'll include the high level signatures that we've gathered by that point in time, but we're going to leave it open because that's our, our sort of gateway in for people who are, it's one of the gateways in for people who'd like to become part of this initiative. We'll be using that list as a way to reach out and, and share what's going on, what sorts of resources and opportunities for engagement and connection there are. And so um, if you have signed or helped others sign the statement, thank you so much. Um, and if you have some new people that you think you'd like to connect with it, please keep on, uh, please keep on doing that. Um, you heard the information earlier, um, but for those who weren't with us earlier, we will send out an email to everybody who registered um, within the next two hours with the location for the starting point for the bicycle demonstration, the bicycle delivery tomorrow morning. Um, if you'd like to reserve a bike to make sure that we've got one for you, make sure you see Safet, who will be taking bike signups until the Muslim prayers start. Um, and thanks to him for doing that. If you'd like to travel and you need to be in one of the bicycle rickshaws, um, let Safet know because we've still got a few places left in those. Good. Make, did you see him? Make sure, make sure you connect with Safet and give him your name so that we can save a spot for you. And that, uh, again, we'll gather at St. Cyprian's Church at 930. We'll have brief prayers from 10 till 1015, and then 1015 we're off, and we'll be handing over the state and, and be, be concluded by 11 a.m. So you'll be, you'll be done in time for lunch. Kiara. Yep, so what we'll do in the email that I'll send, I will also have for people who would like, the, the drop-off point will be right near, right at the edge of the Bula Zone. So we'll include the location where people can come out from the Bula Zone to meet us without bicycling. So if you have friends or colleagues who would prefer not to bike or who just can't because of their schedule but do want to come out even just for 15 minutes, we'll, we'll send that information too. Yes. Yes. Any other questions just about logistics? Yeah. Yes, yep, so they're at, um, on Sunday morning. Um, I will be speaking along with Jeff Powell at the American Protestant Church here in Bonn. Um, and the services there are at 9, 9 and 10.30. We should also announce that the World Council of Churches is organizing a service. And Joy, just say that briefly. Uh, it's at 9.30. <laughs> So uh, it's called Voyaging to an Island of Hope, a worship service for climate justice. It's at the St. Paulus Church. Uh, the sermon will be by uh, 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 Reverend Dr. Olaf at Spit. He's Spit. I always know to say it wrong. He's the General Secretary of the World Council of Churches and also Bishop Barbara von uh, Oldenburg Potter, who is a bishop in, in Germany. And, uh, but we are being joined by senior members of the Fiji delegation and a Fiji choir, and uh, it's a short service. Um, it's at an Anglican church, but it's an economical open service. Great, so we'll, we'll send out information about, about both of those. I think, was there one other question? I saw a hand, yes, ma'am. Asking whether there is a, a sort of website or a possibility of contact, perhaps to get information, or if you put perhaps a live stream you um, made, you put one could see uh, for the morning. Yep, yep. we'll uh, have we recorded. Report. Thanks to Marco. Thanks to the two Marcos and their team. We have everything recorded. We'll be. Um, the, the, all of the materials related right now are on the website interfaithclimatestatement.org, but we'll be, we'll, and we will send an email out with that link to all of the people who've registered for this so that you get that, and then we'll also let you know when the different presentations are, are up there and available. 
So yeah, thank you. Any other questions?